Let's go. Yeah, let's go. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. No, oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irileth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very Aren't much like to see this for dragon. One in no. Shock and Can't to Both. Let's check it. Give me a shield. I don't need a shield, man. This one. Increase shock resistance by 30. Meh. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of caution. Alright, so we finished <coughs> with the objective of bringing the Dragonstone. Now let's find out what's going on. Apparently there is... has been a dragon witnessed outside by the guards. Pick someone's pocket by activating the while sneaking. Look at this cat. It's a nice looking dagger he's holding. Alright, let's follow this. I can run faster than you. Or I can just fast travel. Get the show on the road. I got tired really fast. Seriously? You're gonna fight a dragon and you can't run? Okay, this is the place. Where are the rest? The 
fires everywhere. These are burning bodies, oh my god. He's roasting in there. And I'm taking his stuff. Like I don't care. <laughs> Okay, this is just a burning branch. Oh my god, here it is. I gotta find a place to hide. Okay, time to choose the arrow. Burn me. Come on. Someone turn me off. Perfect. Stay right there. Where right where I can shoot you. Arrow. Yeah. Dragons down. Oh, I thought we were all dead for sure. Me too. Let's take a closer look. Nice dragon. Looks like the one from Game of Thrones. What's happening? Wow. I'm absorbing his power. Turned him into a skeleton. Use the shot section of the magic menu to equip your unrattling voice shot. You mean this one? Your voice is a raw power pushing aside anything or anyone who stands in your path. Nice. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I don't know what happened to me. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn. Shout? Oh, you mean like that? I guess. I've never heard of killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal the power. You must be one. What do you say, Irla? They're being awfully quiet. Come on, Irla. Tell us, do you believe in this Dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them, but I don't need some mythical Dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. 
I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting, what you just did. Must be. You really are Dragonborn, then. Thanks, I guess. Now what? Dragon bone. Oh, they have a good value. I can sell those things. Dragon scales. Gold arrows. Nice. Alright. What now? We taught that dragon not to mess with White Run, didn't we? I've got your back. Serious fight I've ever been in. Lead on. I've been in more than a few. I don't know about this dragonborn business, but I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Run right away. Yarl Bagra will want to know what happened here. Okay. She wants me to report back to the Yarl. So let's go back. Loading, you're sticking forever. Look, you've already been told you're not allowed here. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. The hell has happened? Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You there. We're looking for someone in White Run. And we'll pay good money for information. Who are you looking for? A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in White Run. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Why are you looking for this person? It's none of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Who are you looking for again? Looking for a fugitive who comes from Hammerfell. A Redguard woman. She may be somewhere in this city. Alright, I'll see what I can do. You did it. You killed the dragon. Yes, I did. You should have seen it. It was brilliant. You missed quite a scene. Finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. I know. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. My brother really? needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? The Watchtower was destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irileth. 
But there must be more to it than that. Turns out I might be something called Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? When the dragon died, I absorbed some kind of power from it. So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. Greybeard? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these Greybeards want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thoom or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rangar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeard's business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. Well, thank you. That makes me feel special. Now let's see what kind of weapon did you give me. Damage 10 target takes 5 points of frost damage to health and stamina. So that makes it 20. Not bad. I'll keep it. Okay, I guess I don't need you anymore. Still here. What do you want me to carry? Let's see if you have anything of value that I might take. Yeah, give me your gold. Lockpick. Arrows. More arrows. Well, you can keep the rest. Thank you for your service. I'll head back home if you need me. Well, I probably wouldn't need you, but thanks. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. What were you arguing about? I'd like to train one handed weapon. You're not from Skyrim, are you? Right then. Mm, I don't have time for chit chat.